Now Linda responds. So again, select this one inside the top bar, the profile image. Okay, click the right mouse button and make a duplicate copy. Drag it upward and double click here. Type pro image. Uh, pro image for message. Okay. And Command plus Z to undo. Select this one again, the pro image. Command plus Z. Let's select this folder and press the shift plus down arrow key. Okay. So while this one is selected, let's increase this one. Increase the size, make sure it's locked. The ins in the inspector panel, increase the size to 100 by 100. Okay. And now let's select this one, the message container shape. Make a copy, press Command plus D from the keyboard. Okay. Press the shift down arrow key from the keyboard. Command plus Z. Command plus Z again. We didn't copy that shape. Let's copy it again. Right click the mouse button, duplicate. And now let's press shift plus down arrow key from the keyboard. Uh, so now we have this message container, and now we have to flip it horizontally, change the side, select this one. Oops, sorry, select this one. See, now this, uh, the, the message bubble comes from the right-hand side to the left-hand side. So now let's place it here. Let's place a guide here now. See this corner? It's uh, 74920, 74, 74, 74, 74, From there, let's bring it here and place it at 7513. Place this guideline here. Now go back again, select the profile image of Linda and align this image with the guideline. Oops. Okay. Now again, select this one, the message shape. Press uh, the left arrow key again from the keyboard. Okay, select that again and make it smaller. Okay, select uh, the profile image down arrow key a few times. Again, select the message container. Okay, great. Let's fill the color of this message shape. Fill, and in the hex code, type this, 2DB3C9, press enter, and click the plus icon so this color will be in the global color document. And the next time we need this color, we don't have to copy and paste or type the hex code. So now selecting T from the keyboard. And click here to type. Ha 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 ha. Okay. Click outside of the box. Change the color to white. Okay. This text font is also the same. The Rubik medium and 30. 30 pixels for the size, and the color is white. Place it in the center. Okay. Okay, great. Now, again, this guy will respond. So, let's select the shape. And the shape didn't get selected. Press the command key from the keyboard and select the shape only. It's selected now, rectangle 3. Okay. Now let's press Command plus D 
in order to copy it and press shift plus down arrow key from the keyboard. Okay. Now place it here. Make it smaller. I think this time we have a shorter text line. Now select the T from the keyboard. Click here and type. Where are you from? Bring it here, place it here. And now select this text layer. While this text layer is selected, go to the inspector panel, click uh, on text style, no text style, select create new text style. And here type Tinder user, press enter. So now we have a text style saved as Tinder user. Now select this one. Where are you from? While this layer is selected, click here. From there, select Tinder user. So we will have the same size, same font, and the same color for this text. Now let's place it here. Let's organize this. Select the shape. Let's make it smaller. Okay, great. Now let's organize our layers. Uh, so this shape, uh, select this one. Hold down the command key from the keyboard and select this one. Hey, I don't believe. Okay. So while these two shapes are selected, the shape and the text, press command plus G, command plus G from the layer panel and type here. Message one. And then select the profile image. And this one. No. Deselect this one. Yes. So select this one, the shape of Linda. And ha ha ha. Okay, text. So while these three are selected, plus command plus G from the keyboard and type message two, which is uh, for Linda, the reply message, and select this one, and this one, command plus G to group it, message three, okay, so message two is for Linda. Let's make a copy, this one, press Command plus D. So we have a copy now, let's bring it down by Shift plus down arrow key from the keyboard. Okay, and now she replies again. Type here, from heaven, LOL. Uh, okay, click outside of the text. Select this one, this shape. Increase the size of the shape. Okay, so now we have the conversation in the uh, message screen by the Tinder user and from Linda. So you've learned how to design the text box. Let's press Command plus 1. Okay. And we didn't remove this one, the the bottom bar. So let's select the bottom bar and delete this one. Let's align all the messages. Select this one, message two. Press the down arrow key a few times. Okay, let's type some text. What time message comes? Select the T from the keyboard and click here, type two days ago. Okay. Place it here, make sure it's Rubik regular and um, size is 20 
Let's change the color to light gray, okay? Great. And select this one. Hold down the Alt key from the keyboard and make a copy and place it here. Double click here. And type here, Linda, two days ago. And select this Linda only. Change the color only for Linda to uh, dark gray. Okay, leave it. Again, select this Linda text and hold down the Alt key from the keyboard. Make a copy and place it here. Linda, select this one. Hold down the Alt or Option key from the keyboard to make a copy. Place it here. Okay, great. Let's organize again. Select uh, Linda 2. Press the up arrow key. Right arrow key. Up arrow key. Right arrow key. Select this one. Linda 2. Right arrow key. Okay. Up arrow key. Okay, great. Okay, great. Now let's place uh, the keypad of the Android mobile. To get the keypad, go to the file menu. New from template. Select uh, material design. Hold down the space bar to move this. Get the keyboard. They have two kinds of keyboard. One is black, one is white. So let's select this one, the black one. Okay. Make a copy. Command plus C. Come back here. Command plus V uh, to paste the keyboard. And it, the same way we detached it from the um, symbol, this one is the symbol. See the refresh icon? So click the right-click the mouse button, select Detach from the symbol. So it will be as a folder, this keyboard, dark. And from the toolbar, select the scale. Scale it up to 200. Okay, so the keypad fits in the screen. We don't need this suggestion. Select the suggestion. Press the backspace key. And delete it. Uh, now we have only the keypad. Select the plus, shape, and rectangle. Drag and draw a shape to... 105, 105, okay, release it. So we have a message box to type the message, which uh, the size would be 105. Now click the plus line icon. Let's drag and draw a line. Hold the shift key from the keyboard and make it straight. Leave it. Make sure the thickness is five, press enter. Okay, now press the uh, down down arrow key a few times. Oops, we select this one. Again, select this one. And press the down arrow key from the keyboard. Okay, so we have a nice line. Uh, let's make it light, light gray color. Okay. Now again, select this one and delete it. Let's go to the exercise file. And bring this one, the uh, GIF icon and the send icon. Press Command plus C to copy. Uh, come back to the artboard. Command plus V to paste. And select this one, the GIF. And make it smaller. Select the scale. Downsize to 50%. Press Enter. Place it here. Okay. Down arrow key a few times. Now again, select this one and bring it here. 
scale, 50%, enter, place it in the middle. Okay, great. Now select this one again, GIF, and fill it from the inspector panel. Fill it with the same color we used in the message container, this one, GIF. Okay, great. Let's zoom out. Press Command minus from the keyboard. And now we have a very nice Tinder message screen for Tinder with an Android keyboard. So that's it for the Tinder. Let's type a message now. Send. Send a message. Press T from the keyboard. Click here and type here. Send a send a message. Okay. Click the outside. Place it in the center. Okay. Select the text again and look at the inspector panel. It's Rubik regular 32 and color hex code is BBBBBB. Okay. So now we have a very nice Tinder chat screen. And let's select this line. Let's reduce the opacity to thirty. Thirty. And we have a fabulous message screen. And thanks for watching this lecture. And see you in the next lecture.